Yo, what's up everybody? We are gonna be learning some English cooking slang today. This is how to speak American. I got a lot of requests to have more food in my videos, of course. So today, I'm gonna be preparing my favorite dish for you, chicken fried rice. And while I'm preparing this dish, I'm gonna be introducing some cool American English cooking slang terms. So don't worry if you don't understand everything. You can always rewatch the video again to help you remember. <laughs> All right, so today we start with our mise en place. Actually, this is originally a French word, but it basically means you prepare all of your ingredients together to get ready to cook. So let's get started. So step one is to mince the garlic and the ginger. And mince basically means to chop into very, very, very tiny pieces. Little itty bitty bitty things. This is a super sharp knife. Oh uh, yeah, be careful. Everybody at home, don't do what Nick's doing. Use a spoon. <laughs> the most dangerous knife in a kitchen is a dull one. I bet you didn't know that. And I'll tell you why. Because dull knife makes the knife slip, and then you will actually cut yourself because it slides. Holy shit, this thing is like sharp as fuck. Damn. <laughs> All right, ready? Wait, I'm not ready yet. All right, so there, we finished our mincing. And now we're gonna move on to the garlic, oh no, sorry. And now we're gonna move on to the onions and the chicken. Okay, so the next step is to dice the chicken and the onions. And dicing basically means you cut into small cubes. So a little bit larger than mincing, but smaller than slicing. And the onion. So there you have diced chicken and onions. Third step, you take uh, about three stalks of green onion here. And we're just gonna do a nice easy chop. So chopping is just a general term for cutting. Just simple cuts just like this. So here are some chopped onions, as you can see. Pretty simple to do. <laughs> where are the eggs? In the fridge. So, move these off to the side. All right, so you crack three eggs, and then you add a splash of soy sauce and sesame oil. Throw in a handful of green onions. And finally, beat well. All right, now for the fun part, the cooking. Step one. You heat up the rice by frying it in a pan for a little bit and then set off to the side for later. Step two, fry the eggs in oil. Do a little quick high temperature fry and then put it off to the side for later. Step three, you saute the onions, ginger, garlic, and chicken all together until cooked and then put it off to the side. Step four, throw everything together and stir fry it. And then finally, drizzle on some soy sauce and sesame oil and throw in a handful of green onions and voila, chicken fried rice. So there you have it. This is a relatively simple dish you can get after trying a few times. And remember, practice makes perfect. I recommend watching this video a few times to make sure you learn and also so you can remember the cooking slang that I used today. And as always, I have a neat little quiz to help you remember some of the cooking terms we used. I realized a lot of the terms we actually use today are originally French, but that's because the French are masters of cuisine. <laughs> so thanks for watching today guys you guys know the drill please like and subscribe and leave comments if you like today's cooking video and like today's cooking video please let me know so I can make better videos in the future anyway thanks for watching peace